So tonight we're making a start on the lime plastering uh, using the lime hemp plaster. Um, we've already made a start in this room uh, a few days ago. So as you can see here, you've got two stages. You've got the first layer that's gone on on the rough side there. And this final section here went on uh, two days ago now. And it's been put on as flat as possible ready for the lime skim afterwards. Here you can see where we've taken off all the lime plaster and any loose lime mortar has been picked away uh, to give a good key for the new lime plaster to stick in. As far as preparation, you just want to give it a really good brush down Make sure there's nothing loose, no loose material at all between the stones. And just before you come to do it, give it a good spray down using a garden sprayer uh, with water. So once we cleared down all the walls, uh, first of all we went round and just plugged any of the larger holes with the lime hemp. That just meant these could dry for a day or two beforehand. So even though you can put the lime hemp plaster on in around 25 mil thick in one coat, um, we've decided to do it in two coats just because we found it dried a lot quicker um, and seemed to be a lot easier to work with that way. So this is the first coat going on, um, probably about 15 mil thick, just really evening out all the same work. Um, we've done it with kind of fingertips, so it's left um, a dimpled sort of effect which gives us a really good key to the final layer that goes over the top. Once this first coat goes on, we left it for a couple of weeks to dry and then put the second layer of lime hemp up much smoother this time, getting it as flat as possible and rubbed it down with rubber gloves and also troweled it over to get it nice and smooth. We then ran a couple of nails over it to key it ready for the final skim. <laughs> 